Greetings there, ladies and gentlemen. I am Red Rex. I'm Alex. And we join you with another Nintendo news update. So quickly after the last one, well, I wouldn't really count that news. I would count that more of... Um, kind of like scandal, I guess. Yeah, I mean, but I felt like it needed to be heard. So, so um, the reason why I'm making this video is because I want to give a shout out to Around the Clock. It's a really, he's a, a really cool uh, Nintendo news um, YouTube channel. And he made a video literally about an hour ago at the time of recording this called Square Enix Teases New Info for Blade Default 2. Now, this information that he reads comes from an article on my Nintendo News. The article says basically what he's about to say in the video, but we're going to be relying on the Twitter and I'll probably delve into the uh, article as well. So, Bradley, so the Bradley Default uh, Twitter tweeted this out on October 10th. And if I actually click on the tweet and hit the translate button for it, because I can't read Japanese, I could try, but I'm not going to. I don't think I could very well. So fact, this, not at all. so this tweet, thanks, product, thankfully from Google, says default eighth anniversary. So they're basically saying that this is the eighth anniversary for Baby Default Two, and this is from Mr. E. From this man, I'm not going to try and pronounce his name. Ikushima, I guess. I'm not going to try. If you think about it, it came far away, Mr. Ik Miss This man drew this picture. And it's a really nice picture. It features um, Adia and Ring a Bell from Billy Default 1. I don't know if you know those characters, Alex. Yeah. All right. I have heard of them before. And then this is hashtag Bravely Default 2. I can know, I know that much at least. Information will be available soon, so please check it out. I don't know what this means. M underscore underscore M. Uh, I honestly don't know either. If that's like if that's like um some sort of like internet like um slang, I get it. I don't get it at all. Well, like an emoticon or something. I like I I don't. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I really do not get um. <laughs> I I I to this day I don't know what a a SMH stands for. That's I don't know. This is that's how good I am with it's, internet slang. It's funny because I thought that it meant something else for a while, and I honestly, my mind just keeps going back to it. Like seriously, it means, Zev it knows, means shake my head. Oh, that's what it means. Seriously, like Zev uses internet slang so much. I'm like, what does that mean? And he says, what, me. what did you think it meant? <laughs> I don't know. Like seriously, I don't know what it meant because I don't know what it stands for. Like I, I'm, I'm just like looking there with a blank expression on my face, saying, "What?" For years, I thought it meant so much hell because <laughs> so it's like, much hell. Oh, yeah, like they're giving you like so much hell. So it's like, ah. I'm... I mean, in a way, it, it it almost should be that. It almost should be, uh, like shake my head. Going, so much hell. I keep going back to it's kind of the same. I keep going back to it, and. <laughs> People get fucking annoyed with me. It's like, stop saying that. Like, just you, like, seriously, just shake your head. Like, if you're in, like, in real life, just shake your head. You don't need to say SMH or lol. That's, okay, people who say SMH in real life actually, like, I'm going to slap them. I'm going to be like, are you a human? Are you a human being? <laughs> are you a robot? <laughs> this box. Oh Do you God. see those traffic lights? Tell me which ones are which. <laughs> Where are they specifically? Oh, my God. So yeah, I mean, like, I'm glad that they at least like said that there are is going to be more information on Bayley Default coming out along with this picture. This is nice. Yes, mm -hmm. is, it's a really good picture. <laughs> there's confirmation, which is good. So, and I'm just gonna we're just gonna take a quick look at the article. It probably says the exactly the same thing. I mean, I haven't ex ex actually read the article. This comes from my Nintendo News. I'll be throwing links to around the clock this article and Bayley Default 2's Twitter in the video description. So be sure to check them out. Nice. This entire time I forgot that the music was playing. My bad. <laughs> I opened the tab and I forgot to play the, hit the music button. But it doesn't matter. We're almost done with the uh, with the video anyway. This is a very quick video. Like I just wanted to get this out because I wanted to spread word. So in the circle, spread the word, spread the hype. It says Square Enix says Brady Default Two news set to be announced soon. And here is the image that we just took a look at. Except it's very very big. Mm -hmm. And it says here, Square Enix has confirmed this morning that they are, will be sharing news about the long way and Bravely Default 2 for the Nintendo Switch fairly soon. The announcement was made as part of the celebrations of the original Bravely Default for Nintendo 3DS, which is commemorating its 8th anniversary. 
Brady the Fall 2 still appears to be scheduled for release this year. Information on Brady the Fall 2 will be released soon, so please check it out. The tweet reads, The following Brady the Fall 8th anniversary commemoration artwork illustrated by is attached below. Okay. So, yeah, it's literally the exact same tweet, and... But if I take a look at the tweet, so if for me, let me see. I just want to see if I can like compare this tweet to what it actually says, so that way I can figure out what. So let me see. Uh, information. So please check it out. Oh, I guess it that stand. Okay, I'm, never mind. I'm not even gonna try and. Never mind. So yeah, the article literally just says the exact same thing. You know. They the, just use more words. Yeah. And it actually gives us the first name of the illustrator. Again, yes. not going to try and pronounce Naoki it. Ish I Ikishuma, yes. And you're so good at pronouncing these names. Now. Seriously, you when, when we like when we make videos like this, I'm just going to have you announce the names. All right, just pause and I'll do it then. Get, got it. All right, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, ladies and gentlemen, uh, this is a really, really short video. Like, seriously, how far are we in since we're recording? We are six minutes in. So yeah, a really short video, not as long as the last one. Because literally, like, like seriously, what else do you want me to say about this video? Like, oh, I'm just making this video to say Brady Default 2 is new is coming. I'm expecting a Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase. So, you know, if the October one has this, it will make my day. Please, Nintendo. Please, Square Enix. November release date is seeming a lot more plausible. If not, then hey, December, time for fucking winter holidays. Neat. So, there's that. Like but, I, I'm definitely, I'm definitely expecting a Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase showcase to come out either next week or the week after that, and it has Brady Default Two news in it. In it. Uh, that is the hope. If not, then it has to be in November. But hopefully, and probably, it's going to be this month if they're already saying like more like, is going to be out soon. Yeah, I mean, like this is all like they say it will be released soon, so please check it out. So, I'm definitely, but I'm definitely expecting it to be in the Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase this month. And I mean, if they do do it for November, I mean, okay, but I don't, I feel like they're kind of lying when they say soon. I feel like that's later rather than soon. If it's more than like a month, then uh, it's not that soon. But yeah. Still. But yeah. Uh, news is better than no news, I guess. Mm hmm. Like, I mean, the fact that they're saying that that you will be getting information on this game is better than just them staying silent because, oh my god, for when this game was being talked about, they, like, oh my god, like, I don't know why, but for some reason Square Enix recently has been quiet on news games. Like, Alex, do you know Octopath Traveler, uh, the mobile game? Boy, do I. Rem oh my god, they were so silent on that game. They said it would be, yeah. they, they said they would be delayed to next year, and then they finally released a video, and... Oh my god, like Alex, seriously, like every other like week or so, they're posting a new video about the game's story mode and characters and everything. Wait, really? Yeah, yeah seriously. Nice. The thing is, I just it's... don't want to make videos on that because like it's in Japanese and I don't understand it. Yeah, so unless one of us either gets a translator or learns Japanese, then yeah. Like that the only like the only reason I made that recent video was because we finally got a release date of the game in Japan and because there was also another trailer that was actually translated. There's the only reason I made that video. Fair enough. So well, yeah, still, listen. It's exciting to know that there's news about it. Yeah, I mean like we're like we're getting bombarded with news on that game and hopefully we'll actually get a lot more news on this game as well. That is the hope. So yeah, ladies and gentlemen, um this was a really short video. I'm sorry that it has to be short, but Hopefully the next video will be longer because hopefully that will be where the video where you see me and Alex rage about the Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase, whether it containing Brady Default 2's 2 news. We're gonna rage about it. If it does, Hopefully I'm not. going to be happy and maybe disappointed. And if it doesn't, I'm going to rage and be disappointed. So yeah, there's something to look forward to. Mixed feelings, we'll see what happens, you know? Oh God, I'm so scared. <laughs> so yeah, ladies and gentlemen, uh, thank you so much for watching. Sorry this again. Sorry this is a short video. Um, Alex, thank you for joining me once again on this video. Of course. And hopefully the next video. Hope I know I said this in the last video, but hopefully in the next video you will see me and Alex uh, reacting to the next Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase, which is slated for October if there is one. Thank you all so much for watching. Catch you all in the next one. 
Take care of yourselves and have yourselves a damn good one. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.